Our two children have perished after their house was gutted by fire Tuesday afternoon in Tononoka area of Mombasa County. The deadly inferno gutted down government quarters, which is a two-story building adjacent to the Coast General Teaching and Referral Hospital, where property worth thousands of shillings was destroyed. According to eyewitnesses, the fire could have been caused by cooking gas leakage. The residents have at the same time blamed the Mombasa Fire Brigade for failing to contain the inferno on time, leading to the deaths of two children. Serikali yetu ya Gatuzi la Mombasa wajitahidi zaidi wakati kama kisa kama hiki cha moto kinatokea waje kwa wakati unaofaa na zile magari ziwe ziko tayari ama kile kitengo kiwe kimejipanga kimejihami kwa lolote takalotokea wawe wako tayari manake pia wamechukua muda wa kuconnect zile pipe ingawaje wengine walikuwa wanavunja ile geti lakini pia ni kama ambayo wengine walikuwa hawajazoea ile kuconnect zile pipe sasa ule moto usingekuwa mkubwa zaidi ya, ya, ya hapo Gesi unaweza kuwa umefunga lakini bado ikawa inavuja. Sasa watu wakiconnect magesi wawe makini sana. Yaani mtu achukue fundi wa gesi wa kuconnect kuliko kuchukua tu watu hivi hivi. Unaona? Sababu inakuwa zile nipple ziko loose, gesi kai inatoka taratibu. Ukifunga mlango, ukifunga madirisha, ikija ipata upepo kidogo kuna repuka huko ndani. Hawa watu wa kuzima moto wamejitahidi wamefika hapa mapema. Lakini ile kazi wamefanya hakuna kitu hata cha maana cha kuonekana kimeonekana kwa sababu wao wamekuja wakifika hapo wamezima wameacha maji pipe zenye zinatundu maji ya mwagika nje wanapiga maji maji yanapiga kwa ukuta paka watu wamekufa ndani eh, wamefika on time lakini hawana vifaa oxygen yenye hawana mtu anakuja kuzima moto amvaa jezi anakuja kucheza mpira hapa hii ni mtihani ampata mheshimiwa angalie Utenda kazi wa wazima moto Mombasa County. Miaka yote hawawezi zima moto. Atuogopi kusema. Kuzima moto wa wazimi. Hapa ngekuwa nkuja KPA ama Kenya Navy. Umoto ngekuwa uzima mapema sana.